To start, I'm going to show you three options and then I'll take the one that I feel like is most available to everyone. First option, we're going to start in a restorative fish pose. If you have blocks, you can bring those blocks underneath your shoulder blades and underneath your head. That's option one. If you don't have blocks, option two would be to roll up your mat. This is the version I'll be taking. Roll up your mat and you can slide that right underneath your shoulder blades just to give your heart a little oomph, a little opening, a little spread. Now, if you prefer, final option, just to come flat on your back, that's an option as well. So if you'd like to roll up your mat, I'll give you a second to do that. And then you're just going to slide it right underneath your shoulder blades. It should feel comfortable. Your head should come to the floor quite easily. You can bring your arms into an easy cactus position. Options for the legs. Knees can point straight up to the ceiling. You can widen your feet and let your knees fall in towards each other or bring the soles of your feet together and let your knees open wide. Take your time, find your variation, whatever feels best in your body. Close your eyes. We'll just take a few breaths here. Big, full, conscious breaths all the way up to your heart, into your lungs and ribs. Big, full exhales. Just start to move things through. Big, full breaths in, expanding your ribs, circling your heart with your breath, with your love. Full exhales all the way to empty. Continue with this deep breathing, finding a little more expansion through your ribs and around your heart. love, where the lines of you and I and we are blurred, where we yoke compassion and heart and pulse harmoniously, where words turn to feelings and feelings surrender to inner knowing, nameless, shapeless, fearless, love where we hold each other as and where we are, and it's okay. Where tears make lakes out of the deep holes we dig for each other. And the warmth from each other makes us grow like flowers towards the sun. Love. In love. Be love. Live love, give love. Breathing that love in and around your heart, through your body, out and beyond your body to the rest of the world. Let's take one more big breath in and big breath out. However your legs are, gently close them, bring your feet flat on the floor, knees towards the ceiling, feet are a little bit away from each other, and just take some gentle sways side to side, as shallow or deep as you'd like, finding some release through your lower back, through your hips. Leading with love as we move through our flow today. Gently drop your knees to the right, roll to your right. Come all the way up to sit and stretch your legs out into a moderate straddle. 
Flex your feet, take a big breath in, sit up tall. As you exhale, fold forward. If you're able to catch your feet, catch your feet. Otherwise, bring your hands to your shins or the floor, wherever it's comfortable. Give your head and shoulders a little shake. Allow your torso to release easy. We're gonna take some walks backwards with our sit bones. So I want you to find that right sit bone. See if you can travel backwards with that right side, travel backwards with that left side, and then just keep walking backwards towards your mat or towards the back of your mat if it's unrolled. Once you find your mat, reverse and travel forwards. Taking those sit bones one at a time, a couple rocks forward, and then start to walk back again. Just walking with your tush. Let's take that one more time. Walk forward with those sit bones. One leg getting longer every time you take a step. And then walk back with those sit bones. Pause there. Fold over your legs again. Relax shoulders, neck, head. Take one more breath in. You might gently fold a little deeper as you exhale. Roll all the way up to sit. Cross out your ankles or you can swing your legs around. We're gonna come into a forward fold. So option to roll over those shins or swing your legs around. Feet are hip width apart, knees are soft. Give a little shake to your neck and your head. Plant your left fingers on the floor, soften your left knee. Inhale, reach your right arm up to the sky. Forward fold, twist. Press into your right foot. Get longer from right heel to right sit bone. Get longer from right sit bone to top of head. So spine is long as you rotate. Reach for those right fingertips a little more. Take one more breath in. Exhale, release. Right fingers to the floor, soften through your right knee. Inhale, reach your left arm up to the sky, forward fold twist. Find that length again from tail to head. Find that length from left heel to left sit bone. Reach more through those left fingertips. Take a big breath in. Exhale, release. One more time on the breath. Left fingers ground, left knee bends. Inhale, sweep that right arm up. Exhale, release, right fingers down, right knee bends. Inhale, sweep that left arm up. Exhale, release. Your mat is close by. I want you to grab for your mat and roll all the way up to stand. Take a moment to unroll your mat. Sit your, situate yourself there and we'll all meet at the top of our mats in Tadasana. Big toes touch, hands to heart center. Soften your face, close your eyes. With your hands at your heart center, perhaps today you give a little press, thumb to heart. Allowing the edges of your body to soften. Removing labels or definitions of what love is and just let it be. Let it be in you and then as the edges of your body soften, let it connect you with everything else around you. Bow your forehead to your heart. Surya Namaskara A. Inhale, sweep your arms around and up. Catch left wrist with right hand. Exhale, side bend right. Give a good pull up and over to the right. Anchor through that left foot. Send your hips to the left. Inhale, back through center. Switch your grip. Catch right wrist with left hand. Exhale, pull up and over to the left. Keep your shoulders soft away from your ears. Anchor through that right foot, let your hips press to the right. Inhale, back through center. Exhale, baby back one with cactus arms. Squeeze your tush, send your hips forward, draw your elbows down. Let your heart shine to the sky. Inhale, arms over head. 
Exhale, forward fold, let it go. Inhale, half lift, long spine. Can you pull your heart forward? Exhale, step or jump, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog, heart draws forward and up here. Shoulders are soft, neck is long. Exhale, stretch back, downward facing dog. Soft and humble heart as you drop your head. On an inhale, lift your right leg to the sky. Melt your left heel to the floor. Exhale, scorpion dog. Open your hip, bend your knee. Give a little more push into that right hand. Try and poke that right knee a little higher to the sky. On an inhale, three-legged dog. Re-extend that right leg. Square your hips off. Exhale, right knee, left elbow across your body. Inhale, three-legged dog. Shoot that right leg straight up and back. Exhale, knee to nose, shift forward. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, right knee, right elbow, and step your right foot to the outside of your right hand. Drop your back knee, lizard lunge. Inhale, reach your right arm to the sky, open through your chest. Exhale, yogi's choice, right hand back to the inside of right foot, or maybe right forearm to the inside of right foot. Two more. Inhale, right arm opens, big twist. Exhale, right arm inside, right leg. Inhale, right arm opens, big twist. This time, exhale, right hand to the floor. We're gonna crawl to the left with our hands, pivot on that left knee, turning to face the side of your mat. Right leg is straight, right toes are pointing towards the side edge of your mat, so right foot is parallel with the top of your mat. Press down into your legs, inhale, rise, arms reach to a T. Exhale, gate pose, right hand to right leg, left arm stretches up and over. Continue to soften through those shoulders as you take a nice side stretch along that left side body. Big breath in, big breath out. Inhale, come through center, arms to a T. Exhale, modified side plank. As your left hand lands towards the back of your mat, float your right leg off the floor. Turn your right palm to face the back of your space and reach that right arm overhead. Try and lift your hips a little higher, draw your belly in. Option to stay here, or maybe bend your right knee and catch that right foot with your right hand. If you have that bind, kick foot into hand, open your heart for three. Two, one. If you have that bind, re-extend into that side plank. And on an exhale, right hand lands next to left. Pivot around to face the back of your mat. Push into your hands. Inhale, three-legged dog. Shoot that left leg up and back. Melt your right heel to the floor. Exhale, scorpion dog. Open your hip. Bend your knee. Good. Push more into that left hand. Try and poke that left knee a little higher. Inhale, stretch your left leg straight up and back, three-legged dog. Exhale, left knee, right elbow across your body. Inhale, three-legged dog, shoot that left leg up and back. Exhale, shift forward, knee to nose. Inhale, three-legged dog, left leg up and back. Exhale, left knee, left elbow, and step your left foot to the outside of your left hand. Drop your back knee, lizard lunge. Inhale, lift your left arm to the sky, big open twist. Exhale, left hand or left forearm to the inside of your left foot. Inhale, left arm opens to the sky. Exhale, hand or forearm taps down. Last time, inhale, left arm opens. Exhale, left hand to the floor inside that foot. Start to walk your hands to the right, pivot on that right knee. Square yourself off to the side of your mat. Left foot is parallel to the outer edge of uh, the back of your mat. Left leg is straight. On an inhale, push into your legs, rise to stand, arms to a T. 
Exhale, gate pose, left hand to left leg, right arm reaches up and over, soft shoulders. Press your hips forward towards that left side wall and stretch that right side body long. Take a big breath in. Exhale, modified side plank. As that right hand lands, float your left leg off the floor. Turn your left palm to face the front of your space. Cast that left arm all the way overhead. Find a little more lift through that left hip. Pull your belly in. Option to stay here or add that bind. Bend your left knee, catch your left foot with your left hand. Kick foot to hand, open your heart. Breathe for three, two, one. If you have that bind, re-extend back into side plank. And then we'll pivot around, left hand lands next to right, square off towards the front of your mat. Press into your hands, this time inhale, step to plank, shoot that right leg back. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog, big stretch. Exhale, downward facing dog. Take a big breath in. Big breath out. Have another moment here, reset. On an inhale, rise high in your toes, gaze forward. Exhale, bend your knees, step or jump, feet to hands. Inhale, half lift, long spine. Exhale, fold and let it go. Inhale, sweep your arms around and up, catch left wrist with right hand. Exhale, side bend right. Inhale, center, switch your grip. Exhale, side bend left. Inhale, center. Exhale, baby back bend with cactus arms. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, forward fold, lead with your heart and then drop your head. Inhale, half lift, let your heart pull forward here. Exhale, step or jump, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog, shoulders back, long neck. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your right leg to the sky. Exhale, scorpion dog, open your hip, bend your knee. Inhale, three-legged dog, lift that right leg straight up and back. Exhale, right knee, left elbow, cross your body. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, right knee, right elbow. Step your right foot to the outside of your right hand. Drop that back knee. Three twists. Inhale, right arm to the sky. Exhale, right hand or forearm inside that right leg. Two more. Inhale, open. Exhale, land. One more. Inhale, open. This time, exhale, right hand to the floor. Crawl to the left, pivot on that left knee. Parallel your right foot with the top edge of your mat. Inhale, rise onto your legs, arms to a T. Exhale, gate pose. Take a big stretch up and over to the right. Stay for a breath in. Stay for a breath out. Inhale, rise back to center. Exhale, modified side plank. Left hand lands, right leg floats. Take that right arm all the way over or bend that top knee and catch your foot. Breathe for three, two, one. Re-extend that leg and arm if you're in that bind. Right hand lands close to left. Spin around and square off towards the back of your mat. Push into your hands, inhale, left leg to the sky. Three-legged dog. Exhale, scorpion dog, open your hip and your knee. Inhale, three-legged dog, stretch that left leg straight and back. Exhale, left knee, right elbow, cross your body. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, three-legged dog. Exhale, left knee, left elbow. Step your left foot to the outside of your left hand. Drop your back knee. Three twists, inhale, left arm to the sky. Exhale, left hand or left forearm inside that left leg. Again, inhale, open and twist. Exhale, land. 
One more inhale, open. This time exhale, left hand to the floor. Crawl your hands to the right, pivot on that right knee. Parallel the outer edge of left foot with the back of your mat. Press into your legs, inhale, rise, arms to a T. Exhale, gate pose, stretching to the left. Left hand down, right arm overhead. Take another breath in. Big exhale. Inhale, rise, back to center. Exhale, modified side plank as that right hand lands. Float your left leg, reach that left arm all the way over your head or bend that left knee and catch your foot. Breathe for three, two, one. Release back into that extended side plank. And then left hand to top of mat, pivot around, square off. This time inhale, step to plank. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Have another moment here. Connect to your breath. Feel free to move if you need to release some energy or some tension. Feel free to stay still if that feels nice. On an inhale, rise to toes, gaze forward. Exhale, bend your knees. Step or jump, feet to hands. Inhale, half lift, long spine. Exhale, fold. Inhale, sweep your arms around and up. This time, seal your palms. As you exhale, hands to heart. Let your forehead bow to your hands. Taking a moment, bringing your awareness back to your heart. Surya Namaskar B. Inhale, sit low, Utkatasana. Bending your knees deeply, drawing your hips back. Squeeze your knees together and scoop your tailbone forward. Today, I want you to press your palms and then add a little more lift to your upper body. See if you can take your heart up, your gaze up, and point your fingers straight to the ceiling. I'm calling this extended Utkatasana. Take a big breath in here. Exhale, prayer twist to the right. Just tap left arm to the outside of right leg. Inhale back into extended Utkatasana. Try and stretch those arms straight up, look up. Exhale, prayer twist left. Right arm taps to the outside of left leg. One more time, inhale extended Utkatasana. Exhale, forward fold, let it go, beautiful. Inhale, half lift, long spine. Exhale, step or jump, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your right leg to the sky. Exhale, step your right foot between your hands. Drop your back knee. Inhale, crescent moon, reach forward, up and back. On an exhale, open twist right. Scissor your inner thighs together. Reach your arms back and front. Left arm front, right arm back. Pivot from your belly, your heart, your shoulders, your gaze. Work that gaze around towards that back thumb. And then see that back hand land on your back thigh. Left palm to the ceiling. Inhale, modified exalted warrior. Let that right hand slide down your back leg as you lift your left arm up and back. Send your hips forward towards your front heel. Big breath in. Stay for that exhale. Listen closely. We're going to come up into an open twisted high lunge. Make sure those back toes are touched. From here, you're going to lift your back knee, re-extend that right arm back, left arm forward, finding an open twist in your high lunge. Good, take a breath in. Twist deeper as you exhale. Inhale, front lunge, right arm reaches forward to match left. Exhale, warrior two, open out wide. Inhale, floating warrior, right leg stretches, right toes turn in, reach your arms up. Exhale, warrior two to the back of your mat. Left palm to the ceiling. Inhale, reach back, reverse warrior. 
Exhale, extended side angle, left fingers to the inside of your left foot. Cast your right arm all the way overhead. Again, front knee stays bent. Inhale, reach back, reverse warrior. Exhale, extended side angle. Keep pressing down and out through your feet. This time, inhale, reverse triangle. Left leg stretches straight. Keep reaching your left fingers to the front of the room. Pivot around. Low lunge facing front. Plant your hands, zip your belly in, inhale, shoot your right leg back, three-legged plank. Exhale, three-legged chaturanga, listen closely. Inhale, push right back up, three-legged plank. Exhale, lower all the way to the floor, untuck both toes. Keep your hands grounded, roll your shoulders back. I want you to bend your right knee, so squeeze your right heel towards your tush. Push into your hands. On an inhale, cobra, high cobra. Stretch those arms as straight as you feel comfortable. Your hips can lift off the floor. Let your heart and gaze lift. Let your head drop towards that back foot. And then slowly lower everything, chest and leg back to the floor. Nice, bend that left knee, same thing left side. Press into your hands, inhale, roll into cobra. Hips can lift, heart lifts, drop your head back towards that left foot. And as you exhale, lower everything back down. Good, this time both knees bend, last round. Press into those hands, inhale, roll up. Drop your head back. Exhale, slowly lower everything back down, nice. Push into your hands, send your hips towards your heels, but come to stand on your knees. Walk those hands to the top of your buttocks flesh. Ustrasana, roll your shoulders back, squeeze your elbows in. Give your hips a push forward. Lift your heart and gaze to the ceiling. Start to trace your gaze along the ceiling towards the wall behind you. Take a big inhale. Exhale, downward dog, no rush. Take your time, sit on your heels, hands forward, stretch back. Let's take a big breath in through our nose and then open mouth, exhale. <sighs> Setting up for that left side. Inhale, sweep your left leg to the sky. Exhale, step your left foot between your hands. Drop your back knee. Inhale, crescent moon, reach your arms forward, up and back. Exhale, open twist left. We'll revisit the shape later in a high lunge. Scissor your inner thighs together. Rotate around through your torso, gaze back towards that back thumb, and then follow that hand as it lands to the back of your back leg. Right palm to the ceiling. Inhale, modified exalted warrior. Walk those left fingers down your back leg. Reach your right arm up and back. Send your hips further forward. Take a big breath in. Big exhale. Tuck those back toes. Here we go. Start to lift your back knee. Rise up into high lunge with an open twist. Left arm reaches back, right arm forward. Inner thighs are scissoring together. Take a breath in. Use that exhale to twist deeper. Inhale, front lunge, left arm comes forward. Exhale, open out, warrior two. Inhale, floating warrior, left leg straight, left toes in, arms reach high. Exhale, warrior two to the back of your mat. Right palm to the ceiling, inhale, reverse warrior. Exhale, extended side angle, right hand to the inside of your right foot. Reach that left arm overhead. Again, right knee stays bent. Inhale, reach back, reverse warrior. Exhale, extended side angle. This time, inhale, reverse triangle. Right leg stretches, right arm reaches back. Keep reaching those right fingers to the front of the space. Pivot around, low lunge, facing front. Press into your hands, zip your belly in. Inhale, three-legged plank. Left leg shoots back and hovers. Exhale, three-legged chaturanga. Inhale, press back up, three-legged plank. Exhale, lower all the way to the floor. Untuck your toes, keep those shoulders rolling back. Bend through your left knee. Press into your hands. Inhale, roll up into cobra, any amount. Drop your head back. 
exhale, roll down, release, torso and leg. Bend your right knee, push into your hands. Inhale, roll into cobra, drop your head back. Exhale, slowly lower. This time, both knees bend. Inhale, roll up, drop back. Exhale, lower. Press into your hands, send those hips back. Working towards Ustrasana, stand on your knees. Bring your hands to the top of your buttocks flesh. Shoulders roll back, elbows in. Give your hips a push forward. Lift your heart, your gaze. Maybe this time, hands reach for your heels. Totally up to you. Stay for a breath in. And as you exhale, downward dog, sit on your heels. Hands forward. Take your time. We'll take another big breath in through our nose and out our mouth. Inhale, fill up. Open mouth, exhale. That is our flow. Let's smooth it out. One more time, right and left. Inhale, rise to toes, gaze forward. Exhale, bend your knees. Step or jump, feet to hands. Inhale, half lift, long spine. Exhale, fold. Inhale, extended Utkatasana, hips low, palms pressed. Reach a little more through your heart, arms, and gaze. Exhale, prayer twist right, just a little tap. Inhale, extended Utkatasana, reach up, look up. Exhale, prayer twist left. Inhale, extended Utkatasana, last one. Exhale, forward fold, let it go. Inhale, half lift, long spine. Exhale, step or jump. Chaturanga. Inhale, up dog, push the floor away with your hands and feet. Exhale, down dog, lift your hips, drop your head. Inhale, right leg to the sky. Exhale, step your right foot between your hands. Drop your back knee. Inhale, crescent moon, arms reach forward and up. Exhale, open twist right. Right arm to back leg, left palm to the ceiling. Inhale, exalted warrior, reach up and back. Keep those back toes tucked, lift your back knee, high lunge, open twist right. Stay for a breath in, stay for a breath out. Inhale, front lunge, right arm forward. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, floating warrior, right leg straight, right toes in, reach up. Exhale, warrior two, back of mat. Left palm to the ceiling, inhale, reverse warrior. Exhale, extended side angle, let it sweep, let it flow. Inhale, reverse warrior. Exhale, extended side angle. This time, inhale, reverse triangle, left leg straight. Pivot all the way around. Exhale, low lunge, front of mat. Inhale, three-legged plank, right leg shoots back. Exhale, three-legged chaturanga. Inhale, three-legged plank. Exhale, lower to the floor. Untuck your toes, shoulders back, bend your right knee, push into your hands, inhale, roll up into cobra, drop your head. Exhale, lower. Left knee bends, push into your hands, inhale, roll up, drop your head. Exhale, lower, nice. Both knees bend, inhale, roll up. Exhale, lower. Pushing back to stand on your knees, Ustrasana. Hands can come straight to those heels or to the top of your buttocks flesh. Organize your shape, hips press forward, heart lifts, gaze traces along the ceiling towards the wall behind you. Stay for a breath in. Exhale, downward dog, take your time. Hips back. Hands forward, lift your hips. We'll take a big breath in through the nose. Open mouth, exhale. Left side, last time. Inhale, lift your left leg to the sky. Exhale, step your left foot between your hands. Drop your back knee. Inhale, crescent moon, arms reach forward, up and back. Exhale, open twist left, scissor those inner thighs. Back hand to back thigh, right palm to the ceiling. Inhale, exalted warrior. 
Stay for that exhale. Back toes are tucked. Start to lift your back knee, rise into that open twisted high lunge. Inhale, twist deeper as you exhale. Inhale, front lunge, left arm forward. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, floating warrior, left leg straight, left toes in, reach up. Exhale, warrior two, back of mat. Right palm to the ceiling, inhale, reverse warrior, big stretch back. Exhale, extended side angle, big reach forward with that left arm. One more like that, inhale, reverse warrior, right arm reaches back. Exhale, extended side angle, left arm stretches long. This time, inhale, reverse triangle, right leg stretches, right arm reaches back. Keep moving towards the top of your mat. Exhale, low lunge, top of mat. Inhale, three-legged plank, shoot that left leg back. Exhale, three-legged chaturanga. Inhale, three-legged plank. Exhale, lower to the floor and tuck your toes, shoulders back, left knee bends. Push into your hands. Inhale, roll through your spine. Drop your head back. Exhale, lower leg and torso. Bend your right knee, push into your hands. Inhale, roll through your spine. Exhale, lower. Nice, both knees bend. Inhale, roll up, drop your head back. Exhale, lower. Push into your hands, start to send those hips back. Come to stand on your knees. Ustrasana, maybe you reach straight for those heels. Maybe hands come to your lower back. Open your heart. Keep your hips pressing forward. Easy in your throat. Take one more breath in. Exhale, downward dog. Hips back, hands forward. Take your time. Big breath in through your nose. Open mouth, exhale. Inhale, rise to toes, gaze forward. Exhale, bend your knees. Step or jump, feet to hands. Inhale, half lift, long spine. Exhale, fold and stay. Heel to your feet, hip width apart. Soften your knees, reach down, grab hold of your big toes in yogic toe lock. First two fingers and thumbs wrap around your big toes. On an inhale, stretch your heart forward, lengthen your spine. On an exhale, pull your fingers into your toes, draw your torso over your legs. Give your shoulders a couple rolls. Use those rolls to help slide your shoulders up your back, away from your ears. Push down into your feet to lift and spread through your sit bones. Three slow breaths. Inhale. Exhale, one. Inhale, exhale two, take one more breath in, fold a little deeper as you exhale. Keep a grip on your left big toe, bring your right hand to your right hip, soften through your knees, shift your weight to your right leg and rise up to stand. Keeping that left leg straight any degree. If you need to deeply bend that left knee, that's fine too. Try and draw your left shoulder and left hip back into their sockets. Push down into your right foot, belly in, top of head lengthens to the ceiling. Start to open that left leg out to the left. Add a little more lift through your heart. Extend your right arm up to the ceiling. Breathe for three. Two, one, release and cross your left foot behind your right. Arms come overhead, catch left wrist with right hand. Take a big breath in, exhale, side bend right. You're gonna keep pulling to the right. Let your torso turn towards the floor, just a big circle. All the way down with your torso. Once you find that forward fold, release your hands. Step your left foot towards the back of your mat. Crawl around into a wide-legged straddle. Walk your right fingers in front of your left toes. Reach your left arm to the sky. 
coming into a twist. Push down and out through both feet. Get longer through your spine and continue to rotate around to the left. Big inhale. Exhale, release. Crawl those fingers towards the top of your mat. Left toes turn to point forward. Ardha Chandrasana. Launch onto that right leg. Right fingers to the floor, out in front of you, left arm to the sky. Start to work your torso to square towards that left side wall. Option to stay here or maybe bend that top knee and catch your foot. Kicking foot to hand, open heart wherever you are. Breathe for three, two, one. Re-extend that arm and leg if you're in the bind. Everyone gaze to the floor. Big step back, warrior two. Press into your feet. Inhale, stretch your right leg, prepare. Exhale, trikonasana. Right hip shifts back. Right hand or right shin, left arm to the sky. Keep your shoulders drawing away from your ears. Anchor down and out through your feet. We're here for one more. Inhale. Exhale, low lunge. Hands to the floor, square off. Front knee bends. Drop your back knee to the floor. Coming onto your left fingertips. We're going to make a big arm circle with that right arm. Reach behind you. Try and bend your back knee and catch for the pinky toe side of your back foot. If that's too much, it's helpful to maybe place a block under that left hand. If that's still too much, just release that back foot. Bring your right hand to your right thigh and work that twist. Try and stay soft in your face. Full with your breath. We're here for one more inhale. And on an exhale, gently release. Hands to the floor. Tuck your back toes, lift your back knee. Inhale, step your right leg to plank. Exhale, chaturanga. <laughs> Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale through the nose. Big open mouth, exhale. Inhale, rise to toes, gaze forward. Exhale, bend your knees. Step or jump, feet to hands. Inhale, long spine. Exhale, fold and stay. Heel toe your feet, hip width apart. Softening those knees as much as you need, grabbing onto those big toes. One more time, Padangustasana. Push toes into fingers. Inhale, lengthen your spine. Exhale, pull fingers into toes. Let those elbows bend out to the sides. Push down and out through your heels. Slide those shoulders up your back. Maybe give your head a shake. Let go of tension in your neck. Three breaths, inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, two. Take one more breath in and out. Keep a hold of your right big toe and you'll get toe lock. Bring your left hand to your left hip. Soften your knees, start to shift to that left foot. Work your balance as you come up to stand. Keep a hold of that toe. That right leg can straighten or bend as much as it needs to. Draw your right shoulder and right hip back into their sockets. Push down more through that left foot to stretch that left leg and lengthen through the top of your head. Extend your right arm out to the side. Extend your left arm up and out to a high V. Heart is lifted. Breathe for three, two, one, gently release. Right leg crosses behind left. Take those arms overhead. Catch right wrist with left hand. Inhale, get taller. Exhale, side bend left. Continue to move to the left. Let your torso face the floor as you fold all the way down over those legs. 
Step your right foot back, crawl your hands to the right, wide-legged forward fold. Walk your left fingertips all the way in front of your right foot. Reach your right arm to the ceiling. Push down and out through both feet. Spin your torso to the sky. Stay long from tail to head as you twist. Big breath in. Exhale, release. Start to walk your hands towards the top of your mat. Turn your left toes to face front. Ardha Chandrasana, launch onto your left leg. Left fingers extend to the floor out in front of you, right arm to the sky. Can you work your torso to square off to the right side of your space? Stay or maybe bend that top knee and catch your foot. Breathe for three, two, one, if you have that bind, re-extend leg and arm. Everyone gaze to the floor. Big step back, warrior two. Press into your feet, inhale, stretch your left leg, prepare. Exhale, trikonasana. Hip shift back, left hand lands. Soften your shoulders away from your ears. Think of pulling the top of your head forward, spinning your left ribs and heart to the sky. Push down and out through your feet. Take one more big inhale. Exhale, low lunge, hands to the floor. Bend your front knee, square off, and then drop your back knee down. Working into that quad stretch, come onto your right fingertips. Big circle with that left arm up and back. Bend your back knee and catch for the pinky toe side of that foot. Feel free to modify as needed here. Kick foot to hand, open your heart. If this is too much, you can release your foot and bring your left hand to your left thigh and just work on that twist. Take one more breath in. Exhale, release. Tuck your back toes, lift your back knee. Inhale, step to plank. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog, stretch. Exhale, downward. Facing dog. Inhale in through your nose. Open mouth. Exhale. Inhale, lift your right leg to the sky. Gaze to your hands. Exhale, setting up for a pigeon variation on the right. Slide your right shin forward. Scoot your right knee, uh, sorry, left knee and left toes back. So variation one, you can come onto those fingertips and stay upright right here. If you have a big gap between that right hip and the ground, you can place a block, a pillow, some support underneath there could be helpful. From here, another option is to bend that back knee and reach your left arm around for a little quad stretch, squeezing that left heel in. You might just use that left hand on your foot or if you feel comfortable there, you can sneak your left foot into the crease of your left elbow. If you feel comfortable there, right arm me, right, might reach up and around. Press your head into your right arm, work to square your hips as best as you can. Breathe for three, two, one. Gently releasing to those fingertips, take a big breath in. Exhale, sleeping, pigeon, nice. Let it go right here. Close your eyes. Work to soften. Release the tension, the gripping, the resistance. No rush to get there. Take your time.
Start to walk your hands back in. Tuck your back toes, step back, downward dog. Take whatever you need in down dog. Feel free to pedal your legs. You could even scorpion dog that right leg if that feels good. And when you're ready, we'll change to the left. Inhale, lift your left leg high, look forward. Exhale, setting up for pigeon variation on the left. Walk your right knee and right toes back. Maybe you prop that left hip up if there's a big space between that hip and the floor. Come on to your fingertips, just starting there. If this feels good, stay here. If you'd like to add that quad stretch, right arm reaches back behind you, catch that foot and start to squeeze that foot in. So the more you can walk that right knee back, the easier this is to access. This might be where you stay. Maybe that foot slides into the crook of your right elbow. Maybe left hand comes up and around and goes for the bind. Try and press head into left arm. Work to square your hips as best as you can. Breathe for three, two, one. Excellent, gently release to those fingertips. Inhale here and on your next exhale, fold. Sleeping pigeon. Hmm. Big, big exhales. Big, big inhales. Take a few more breaths, see if you can let go a little more. Drop in a little deeper. Start to walk your hands back in. Tuck your back toes, step back, downward dog. Give those legs a pedal, last down dog of class. Take whatever feels good. Inhale, rise to toes, gaze past your hands. Exhale, bend your knees, jump your feet through your hands, have a seat and make your way onto your back. We're just gonna take one back bend today, but we'll hold for a juicy five breaths. So yogi's choice, if you'd like to come into bridge pose, arms alongside your body, heels in close to your tush. If you'd like to come into Urdhva Dhanurasana wheel, hands by your ears. Wherever you are, inhale, prepare. Exhale, press into your feet, tuck your tailbone, lift your hips. Five breaths. Inhale. Exhale, one. Inhale. Exhale, two, inhale, exhale, three, inhale, exhale, four, last breath in. As you exhale, tuck your chin, slowly lower down. Roll out your wrist if you were in wheel, let those legs gently sway right and left. Start to draw your knees in slowly. Left hand to left knee, right hand to right knee. And let's just make some big circles. Open your knees wide, let them circle back in. A few circles in one direction. And then reverse and circle the other way.
Come back to center with your legs. Flex your feet. Catch for the outer edge of your right foot with your right hand. Extend that left leg long. Half happy baby. Give a good pull on your right foot with your right hand to bring your right knee closer to the floor outside your torso. Getting into your hips. And then release, bring both hands to your right shin. Squeeze your right knee in, take an inhale here. And on an exhale, easy twist. Gaze to the right. Let that knee fall to the left. Inhale, come back through center. Hug both knees back into your chest. And we'll switch. Half happy baby on the left. Flex your feet. Catch for the outer edge of your left foot with left hand. Extend your right leg long. Pull that left foot and left knee closer to the floor. Breathe. Release and squeeze your left leg in with both hands. Inhale, exhale, twist. Take that knee to the right, look left. Inhale, come back through center. Hug both knees into your chest. Wrap your arms around your shins. Bring your forehead to your knees. Squeeze in for five. Push your mid back into the floor. Four, three, two, one. Release and set up for final rest. If you'd like to bring the soles of your feet together, knees wide. We did a lot of back bends today. That might be nice on your back. If you prefer, though, to stretch your legs out long, go for it. Allow yourself to settle into comfort, into ease. Close your eyes. And just let.
start to deepen your breath. Sipping your breath up and around your heart. Exhaling all the way to your fingers and toes. Add some movement there. Let your head sway side to side. Use these tiny movements to bring you into a big full body stretch. Legs long, arms overhead. Walk your heels in towards your seat. Bend your knees, roll to the right. And on your own timing, make your way up to a comfortable seated position. Close your eyes, bring your hands to heart center, take your time. Perhaps you give a little press, thumbs to heart, acknowledging your heart space. Ending with this little love poem by Pablo Neruda. I love you without knowing how or when or from where. I love you straightforwardly without complexities or pride. So I love you because I know no other way than this. Where I does not exist nor you. So close that your hand on my chest is my hand. So close that your eyes close as I fall asleep. The divine light and love in me bows to, sees, and honors the divine light and love in you. Namaste.